All right, one more email. I shouldn't read this, but here we go. It's from Scott. Uh, the other night I was indulging in some pornography on the web, as one would do, when I found a model that I found quite attractive. He, he really, there's a quite a preamble on this thing. I feel like it's excessive, but here we go. I found a model that I found quite attractive, interested in seeing some of her other work. I typed her name into Google and found that she had a Twitter. I started to look at some of the pictures she had posted to her account, and I noticed that for every naked picture of her, there seemed to be two of her vaping. <laughs> I then noticed the hashtags vape, vaping, vape life, vape porn. Uh, I asked mm. myself and the universe, what the hell is vape porn? I decided to go further down this you rabbit know. hole. You well, know I, what it is. No, actually, this, this is actually weirder than you think. Oh. I decided to go further down this rabbit hole, and I find out that she has her own line of e-liquids produced by a company called Blaze Vapors. And now I'm off to Blaze Vapors' Twitter page, where they claim that they sell celebrity premium e-liquids. Okay. Their, their list of celebrities is only four long, and the most famous person on the list is none other than Ron Jeremy. Yes, Ron Jeremy has his own premium <laughs> e-liquid line, aptly named Jeremy. Premium. With premium flavors such as Exotica, French Kiss, Fantasy Bowl, and the Creme de la Creme ah. Hedgehog. Hedgehog, of course. So my yeah. question is, how much money would it take for all of you to inhale some of Ron Jeremy's Hedgehog? Oh, God. No, I, I don't. That's a long email I don't, for the yeah, ending joke. Yeah, it, yeah. Like I said. Okay. I'm it takes not, a while to get there. I am not interested in vaping any liquid, anything. What do you think goes? What goes into the design process for celebrity e liquids? What goes I, into the liquid? That's what I mean. Like, how do you determine what? What? I mean, the, is it this the same as like that out there too? Some guy made sixty five bucks the hard way <laughs> vaping something he shouldn't be vaping. Uh, is it that? Is probably just the same thing as like when a celebrity puts out a line of perfume or something, right? right? Where yeah. it's like I they smell it and say, "Yeah, go for it." And I don't know. There's probably just some process where that's it's either like depending on how engaged the person is, like you can go like, "Well, I, I want something that's like hints of cinnamon because that that speaks to my character," or someone, or they just go like, "Well, we have a flavor that's uh, it's like cottage cheese." <laughs> Mixed with stale cigarette smoke, and, and, and it's like, oh yeah, sure, put my okay. name on that one. I All guess right, I don't yeah. know. Stale cigarette smoke, um, I can see. And, sure, or, or I, yeah, who knows? Smell of rented leather couch, right? Yeah, like like how hands on. I mean, but that that applies to any branded thing ever. Is like how hands on is the celebrity involved? Right. You know, when the Snoop Deville was coming out, yeah. <laughs> the what? Or the Snoop De Grill? Yeah. Uh, I only buy my gold through uh, Jeff Jarrett. It's better gold. Yeah. I mean, that guy wears gold around his waist. That's true. Higher yeah. quality. Higher purity. Yeah. Uh, yeah, exactly. It's, it's how, how hands-on is the celebrity, or are they just throwing their name on something for a fee? Um, hey, man. Ron Jeremy cares about the integrity and the quality. It's premium. Of his, of his own personal e-liquids. I sat behind Ron Jeremy on an airplane not that long ago. What? And there was a certain smell that I, Ugh. you know, if they could capture that oh, in a vape, no. I might say don't. <laughs> right. <laughs> that was Hedgehog. That was Hedgehog. <laughs> Why do I feel like that's not your only Ron Jeremy on an airplane story? Uh, it's, right, it's, it's not my... It's not, swear that it's, you've talked about him before. Well, it's certainly not my only Ron Jeremy story, oh, but boy. it's the only Ron Jeremy on an airplane okay. story. Okay. He did not recognize me. Hmm. <laughs> Is fine from the last time. Yeah. All right. Good to know. Was he in the middle aisle? Uh, window. Mm. Pretty empty flight. Okay. Not not first class. Nope. Flight coach. Yeah. Ooh boy. All Ve right. Vegas to L.A. You yeah. wouldn't get first class for that flight. It's too short. No. Yeah. Yeah. I guess so. Because you're always going to pay like what? Yeah. Is the premium? It's probably not worth it. No. For totally. It's or like, yeah. It's like a hundred dollar flight or something. You know, it's yes. Vegas flights to Vegas to L.A. Or it's like nothing. Yeah. All right. That's it for emails. Bombcast at giantbomb.com. Like, uh, what, uh, what's his name? Fucking uh, Jason Muse has his yes. own like lengthy line of vape fluids sure. and stuff. Of course he does. That's like he stopped in the office. Yeah, he was. He was in this. He was, he was in this building not long ago. <laughs> the, probably because of, of the no. no I yeah. recognize the voice. I didn't. Right so yeah. I didn't recognize the voice because I just heard someone walk through the door and there's that fucking Fallout Four Pip Boy or yeah, the yeah, yeah, the yeah. Vault Boy thing there. And he's went like, yeah, Fallout 4, I like that game. And I was like, what is like this 90-year-old man <laughs> shouting about Fallout? I'm like, that sounds like Jay from Jay. And yeah, turn over and yeah, sure, sure enough. I, it wasn't until you said that it was him that I put it together because <laughs> no point did that voice sound like oh, really? that dude to me.
Like to die. But when you like look up interviews of him recently, where yeah, he more is, recently. where he is promoting his e liquids, <laughs> uh, which you, let me tell you, the YouTube vaping community, most of them seemed pretty excited to oh, be I'm talking sure. to Jay from <laughs> Jay and Silent Bob. Pat, Pat, what's Pat, his line called? Uh, Muse juice. Muse juice. Yeah, yeah that, that sounds, is. That sounds right. Uh, hmm. But there's a lot of overlap there. Yeah. yeah. Uh, all right. That's it for oh, emails. Oh, vaping. Yeah. It's good times. Uh, All roads lead back to the nightmare yeah. of we can't. vaping. We can't seem it's to a, escape at some point. There's we can't no, seem to escape it. There's no vape escape. <laughs> <laughs> Not yet. Uh, all right. Drew threw his headphones off. I guess that means we have to go.